Southwest Africa, Mali was hit by several violent attacks over the weekend. A Malian army spokesman says a gunman, gunman killed 10 civilians in an attack Saturday on the village of Gaberi in northern Mali, just a day after Islamist gunmen raided the Biblos Hotel in Sevare, 600 kilometers northeast of the capital, Bamako. At least 12 people were killed in the hotel attack, including a United Nations staffer. Gillian Kitchener of Reuters has more on the hotel siege. This is what's left after a nearly 24-hour siege of a hotel in central Mali by suspected Islamist gunmen. Authorities say at least 12 people were killed, including hostages, soldiers and four gunmen. The terror finally came to an end before dawn on Saturday, after security forces stormed the building and released some of the United Nations workers who had been trapped inside. The day before, Malian forces used heavy weapons like rocket-propelled grenades in a failed attempt to dislodge the gunmen. The attack on this now quiet but bloody scene was the latest in what appears to be a growing Islamist campaign against Malian soldiers and UN personnel. Now, just days before the attack, a Malian Islamist militant under an international arrest warrant was freed from detention in Mauritania, according to a group investigating crimes by Islamist insurgents during their occupation of northern Mali.